In this work, we present a set of sketch-based tools for manipulating 3D objects. To translate an object, the user first selects it and then draws a stroke in the desired translation direction. The system automatically creates axis-constrained translation and rotation widgets. The widget is dismissed automatically when the object is deselected. Axis strokes can be drawn anywhere on the screen, facilitating quick interaction. The system finds the nearest axis to the stroke. World axes in white and object axes in green are considered automatically. To precisely pick another axis, the user drags on the small disk widget. The cube widget uniformly scales an object. The user can also cross the cube to toggle between translation and scaling axes. To translate and rotate in the screen plane, the user draws a perp gesture. Drawing the same gesture across a translation axis converts it to a translation plane widget. The perp gesture can also be used with rotation widgets to create a new rotation in any perpendicular plane. Widgets can be made persistent, or pinned, by double crossing them. Pinned widgets stay on the screen and can be used until the user dismisses them with another double cross. Here the user quickly constructs a system of pin widgets to simultaneously interact with two objects. Drawing a pigtail stroke drops a pivot point, which can then be moved around like other objects. Selected objects can be bound to a pivot by crossing it. Once bound, interaction is applied relative to the pivot point. Drawing a line from a pivot to another point on the surface creates a snapping suggestion. Crossing the suggestion applies the snap. Drawing the perp gesture across the suggestion causes a snap with surface normal alignment. A longer stroke ending with a pigtail enters a transformation stroke mode. Each time a line stroke is drawn, the red arrow is aligned with it in the screen plane. To exit the mode, simply deselect the object. Created widgets and pivots are tracked in a widget history or timeline. The user can scrub back in time to apply previous widgets to the selected object. In this example, the user wants to translate the ladder step up the beam, but there is no suitable axis. Using history to transfer the beam's axis to the step makes the task quick and precise. In this demonstration, we show an experienced user assembling a chair using our tools, the same task that our study subjects performed. This user demonstrates how widgets, snapping, and history are all easily accessible in our system and can be fluidly combined. This clip is playing at double speed. It took the user just over two minutes to complete the task after one practice run. For reference, our fastest study subject, who is an expert 3D modeler with many years of experience, also took two minutes to complete the task in the commercial tool Maya.